Hey guys, MGH here and welcome back to my Bradford City career mode. We're taking them to the Premier League. It's my new career mode. Really hoping you're enjoying it. Enjoying it. If you haven't uh, seen the last episode, please do go ahead and check it out because we made two offers to transfer, um, you know, two free agents to our team. We've got Pedro Azog, the CDM, and Yang Hyung Su, who is a defender. But it looks as if they were not happy with the uh, the offers I made. So let's go and have a look. He wants two thousand per week which you know it's fair enough but he's he's not with the club so I'm, I'm guessing he will go down let's try 1.5k we did try 1.2 and he said no so I reckon he might just go for that obviously I don't have much money so I really need to be saving as much as I can um he wants 2,000 as well so we'll do the same we'll go with 1.5k oops that's 1.4 Matt come on wake up there we go and uh, see if they they take that because I don't think it'd be fair to pay full price for for someone who's sitting there not in a club not being used, you know, you, you think they just want to join, you know, but let's advance, we're going to play two more games in this episode, hopefully three actually, and we'll see how we get on, because the league, it wasn't the best start ever, we got a draw, it was a nil-nil, but then we had the Capital One match, and we won 3-1, two goals from Wells, one goal from Hansen, we're doing great, it's not too bad, we haven't lost yet, and I'm happy. Honestly, I have no idea what's going on in this game, I'm struggling so much to get past their defence, there is something wrong with me, I can't can't do anything let's see if when I'm talking it's better because I've been so silent maybe I'm thinking too much sometimes you just need to let it <laughs> just let it happen you know let yourself pass around without thinking about it too much um, but I'm struggling and again it's in the league you know I, I, I drew the first game nil nil um, probably should have won it I had three or four really good chances to score but didn't manage to get it look at that another corner given away um, just really struggling. Don't know what it is. We're 56 minutes in. It's still nil-nil. And I'm just hoping it doesn't end like that. Oh, no. Ooh. No. Man, that's frustrating when that happens. But, um, yeah, I just don't know what's going on, really. Maybe I need to change formation. Maybe 4-2-3-1 just won't work with this team. I don't know. Um, I definitely need to do something. Whether I just need to get a new player or two. Oh, hang on. Hang on. Come on. Oh, my God. I almost got through. Go on. Cross it. Go on. Oh, my God. Handsome. Just wasn't in the right spot. I thought for once, I'm not going to go near post. I was going to cross it over and it just didn't work. But here we go. Come on. Oh my God. This is so frustrating. I can't score. Yes. Yes. I have to finesse this one. Oh my God. No. No, 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 no. Tell me that didn't just bounce past me like that. My God, I'm getting unlucky. It's just one of those matches. I'm going to have to accept it. I'm going to have to get a bit of luck to score. Oh, that's a good tackle. Look at that. All right. Come on, Davis. Pump that up. No. Bad pass. Yep. Again, it's finished nil-nil, guys. Just not good enough. I'm struggling to score in the league. I don't know what it is. I'm going to sort it out. I'm going to change formation. Maybe that will help me out because something just isn't right. I don't know what it was. But again, we finish nil-nil and we only get two points out of a six. That is just not good enough. And I can't sign these guys for less than 2k by the looks of it. One last try. I'm going to go for 1.8. Every little helps, you know. Maybe if I give them important first team player, they'll feel a little bit more excited about joining. Because this just, look, he wants 2,000 as well. It's looking like they just will not join for anything less. So uh, it's last resort. Let's go for 1,800 on important first team player. Because they will play. Let's see how that goes. They should just bloody accept it. They haven't got a club. I mean, come on. Right, so I'm going to change formation. Like I said, I would. I'm going to go for a 3-5-2. Just give it a go. I know I use 3-5-2 a lot in career mode, but I think it's the only way I'm going to actually win a game, maybe. Um, we'll take off Meredith. He's the lowest uh, lowest rated de defender there. We're going to put on Oliver instead. Um, but we do have a game against Rotherham United. Should be an interesting game. They're currently in second. Let's see if we can get ourselves into the top half of the table because I'm not even there right now, and it's, it's depressing. Oh, my God. How did I score that? I was just literally about to start saying how strong 352 is just for pressuring the ball. The team pressure that they put on other players is just so much better than 4231 on career mode anyway. And it forced them to make an error with the pass there. Hansen has the shot which gets parried and Wells is super quick to the rebound. Finally we score in the league. My god. About time. Go on, make it. Oh look at that. Have we got a runner, have we got a runner, Hansen? No, oh my god, the run wasn't good enough. Good tackle, look at that. Well in, son. Here goes Wells. Second goal. It is. Look at that. 
26 minutes in. Wells has got his second in the league. Hansen is man of the match so far. What a tackle that was. Great pass right to his foot. Poor touch, but it actually worked out well for Wells there. And he could just smash it into the bottom corner. 2-0, yes. I'm so happy. Now, this is what you could you call a good free kick placement. I mean, <laughs> this couldn't get any better. We've got Jones, who seems to be the best free kick taker here. We've got Doyle there. Good power, but not the best curve. Looks like Jones is going to take it, the 35-year-old. I think he's 35. Let's see if we can get a goal with him here. Nice bit of curve on this. Oh, my God, it's perfect. Look at that. 3-0. Why are they second in the league? I'm absolutely destroying them. Ever since I've changed to 3-5-2, what a difference. And let's have a look at this free kick. I mean, it's literally perfect. It wasn't very high, but as long as it beats the keeper and goes in the back of the net, who gives a crap? That was, ah, oh, stunning free kick from Jones. And that makes it three goals in 35 minutes. I think we've got our first win in the league, guys, already. Game over. That was one of the best, half, best first half performances I've had in a long time. I mean, look at that. 3-0 against Rotherham. Like I said a second ago, it's looking like it could be game over already. That was a really nice reaction. Look at that from Wells. He was just ready for it. Um, look at that. Northampton are 3-0 up against Dagenham as well. So I'm hoping that I'm obviously going to get promoted this season. And it's looking like I'm going to be one of the stronger teams. But it's probably a little bit early to tell that. Um, we'll see how we get on. Maybe towards Christmas I can make more of a judgment on that. And when I say Christmas, I obviously mean in-game. Oh my god, I don't even think about Christmas in real life yet. What a pass. What a goal. My God, Jones. Please don't retire at the end of the season. Please. What a goal. Look at this pass. Little reverse ball. Great first touch from Wells. And it's a great finish. And that is a hat-trick, yeah? I think that's his hat-trick. Wow. Bit of a delayed reaction to the actual goal, but that's because I'm half asleep here. <laughs> wow. So happy with that. What a great game. 4-0. Absolutely fantastic. Wells hat trick. I'm sure he's going to be top of the, the score sheet now um, in the whole of the league. Top scorer. It was a really great game, that. And look at that. Jones got man of the match. Not even Wells, who scored a hat trick, got man of the match. Jones did. Fantastic game. Uh oh. Looks like we've got three bad news emails here. Player injured. Oh, that's right. Atkinson's out for five days. He should be back for the next match. And uh, yeah, it's not going to happen with these players. It's, it's either for, uh, sorry, 2,000 for four years or nothing. So we're just going to have to bite the bullet and spend the cash just to just to improve the squad for the season. And then we can start buying proper players or scouting them. As long as you guys are happy with that. I haven't read the comments yet because I haven't uploaded the first one yet as I'm recording this. Um, but we'll soon find out whether that's something I want to do. But there we go. That should be okay, I reckon. Two new players, free agents, nice and cheap. Should be absolutely fine. Let's move on to the next one. Um, really? He wants to understand the role. I'll tell you what your role is, Azog. Just play football, because you're not doing it at the moment. Oh, what is wrong with you? We'll go for important first team player, although I'm not sure where he'd fit in, seeing as Jones is playing so well at the moment. Um, but the other player has accepted. Thank God for that. It's taken a little bit of a chunk out of the budget, but that's all right. It's it's worth it. I think that we need a couple of players just to bulk up the squad. You know, um, I'm I'm stay I'm going to stay with three five two. The difference in the team, wow, I couldn't believe it. I just won four nil as a three five two. So I think that says a lot about the team. So I'm just going to sort this out, and then I will talk to you in a second. I've sorted the team out. We're in a 3-5-2 now. I've really, really got a nice squad, not just on the on the pitch. We've actually got some good substitutions as well. And uh, I fit the new free agent that we got. I think he's Korean. I'm not too sure, but I've got him on the bench if I need him. We should have a Zog. Hopefully, he will accept the contract. If not, it won't be the end of the end of the world, actually, because I might, might be better off without him. I don't know, because I can actually afford a different player then. But we're looking good. We now have a game against Bristol Rovers. Um, who have lost their last three games. So I'm, I'm looking like I could be in with a win here. This is a great start to the match. Look at this. Oh, that was disappointing. Look at the space. All right, come on, Brown. Oh, look at Hansen. Perfect movement. Surely a goal. No. Oh, yeah. No, 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 no. Wow. That didn't happen, surely. Miss of the season. Surely miss of the season. It was an open goal, Hansen. What's wrong with you? Oh, what a goal. 
Wells is an absolutely stunning striker. I can't wait till he hits the mid-70s. His, his stats are going to be incredible. But look at this. Great first touch. Little fake shot. Found the space. Smashes it through about three different players. Keeper has no chance. All right, I'm going to make a prediction. Wells will be the top scorer of the league. Simple as that. And it's another goal. Thank you, Jones. Thank you, Bristol City. I think we're on to another win here. 3-5-2. What a formation. There's just so much space for the uh, the attacking players. Look at this simple cut inside there. Defenders just don't know what to do. It's a really nice finish as well from Jones. And uh, I'm actually going to go ahead and check his age. Let's have a look. I'm pretty sure he's 35. He did say he was going to retire at the end of the season. Let's have a look. Yep, he's 35 years old. But just look at these stats. He's still got really nice stamina, nice strength. His pace isn't great. But you look at these stats. He's a very balanced player. That's why I like him and that's why I'm using him. Um, but he is going to decrease so quickly this season. So use him while I can. Replace him at the end of the season, that's for sure. Whoa. Wow. I am literally shocked. I didn't think it was going to go in. I thought it was going to go blasting over the bar. And I wasn't going to need to say anything. But my God. Straight from the kickoff. Look at this. Boom. That That is worthy of an instant replay. I'm sorry, guys. I wasn't expecting it to go in. But have a look at this. The way the ball set up for him. I mean... That is like the perfect height for a volley. Look at this. Boom. I don't think any keeper would have saved that. I mean, that's literally in a top corner. Look at this. That is literally top corner. Look at that. Top of the net. What a goal from Wells. No. No. My clean sheet. No. Harold has got himself a goal. I've got to give it to Bristol City. They have done okay, you know. It's not like I'm slaughtering them. And they've got a ginger wizard up front. That is a really nice finish. Poor poor goalkeeping. I do need to get a new goalkeeper at some point. But that makes it 3-1. We're still in control though. And that is full time guys. Another great win for Bradford City. Look at that. 3-1. Wells with another two goals. He couldn't quite get the hat trick. But another great result. Simple as that. We've got another three points. Very, very happy with that. Wells again getting over nine rating. And it's another away win, which is another important point. Getting those three points away from home is exactly what we need to do at the start of the season. But thank you so much for watching, guys. If you're enjoying these episodes, please prove it to me. Hit that like button. Maybe we could hit 3,000 on this one. I'd really, really appreciate it. And I will see you in the next one tomorrow.